banana. <laughs> That wasn't as cool as I thought it would be. We are making chocolate chip banana muffins. This is one of my family's favorite snacks, perfect for back to school or just a snack on the go. I think you guys are gonna love it and it's totally easy and I'm craving some banana muffins, so let's get started. Nope, I'm gonna break something. <laughs> Better quit while I'm ahead. My kitchen smells so good and so cozy, like fall baking. I am totally ready for that. They've cooled in the pan for about five minutes. Now you can transfer them to a rack. You can use a little fork or something to help you, but they should slide right out, especially if you used the liners. And a little note about these liners. These are actually parchment liners. I will link to what I'm using in the notes. They bake really well. They release really easily. You know how sometimes you'll get like some of your muffin or your cupcake still attached to the liner? <laughs> I don't like that. But these liners don't do that, which I love. And these keep really well, just like our banana bread and our chocolate chip banana bread and our chocolate banana bread from our cookbook. It'll stay moist and beautiful for several days. So these are absolutely make ahead friendly. You can even freeze them if they last that long, which they won't. I'm just gonna tell you right now. <laughs> Let's do this taste test. I'm gonna get my kiddo because she has been waiting for this. Diana! All right, taste tester, come on. All right, are you ready for a banana muffin with chocolate inside and chocolate on top? Yes. Yes? <laughs> all right, which one do you want? They all look so good. I have two. Oh, we'll talk about that later. <laughs> let's, start, let's start with one, okay, unwrap it. Show them how good that parchment wrapper comes off. It's beautiful. Look at that. No muffin was lost in this wrapper. I love it. Hey, here we go. Wait, 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 wait. Let's do this together. Which one should I take? Hold on, wait for me, wait for me. I know you're eager. There's a, hold it, Spr freeze, freeze, freeze. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ready? Okay. Oh. What about oh. me? What do you think? You're already chocolatey. Oh, hey, hey, get back here. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> She was taking it to dad, you're so sweet. What ah. do you think? Look, how, show them how much chocolate is inside of yours. There's chocolate inside, chocolate on top, chocolate on those lips. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> it is moist inside, just so much great banana flavor. And they're not too sweet, just a lot of natural sweetness from the banana and then the chocolate chips. Cut the sweetness a little bit because we use semi-sweet chocolate. 
It is so satisfying. It tastes like dessert, but I think this could be breakfast. What do you think? Mm -mm. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Oh boy, you are so chocolatey. Bye-bye. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> These are so good and so simple to make. Make them once and you will make them over and over. Also, if you love banana recipes or desserts and you haven't got your hands on our new cookbook yet, I think I just got it all like banana greasy. It's okay. A good cookbook is supposed to look messy and dirty and chocolatey, right? <laughs> From lots of use. Anyway, I will link to our cookbook in the notes. Let me know if you guys have any recipe requests. I would love to hear from you. And let me know where you spotted Sharky. And we'll see you on the next episode of Natasha's Kitchen. Now I need to go finish my muffin. That's so good. Let me just, let me show you the inside a little bit. It's just like melty, melty morsels of chocolate. This has my name written all over it. And these are so good. Mm. What? Get back here. Are you still recording? <laughs> You have chocolate in your teeth too. <laughs>